Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and somebody contacted me today wanting to know how to create this shape where you have two flat bottoms and two rounded bottom, or two the top ones are rounded over. I guess he's making a part for something, and this is a 15 degree angle. There's probably several ways to do this, but this is how I would do it. I'm going to get my guideline, and I've got everything on Snap2. I've got Snap2 guideline, Snap2 object, and Snap2 page turned on. I'm going to double click on my guideline and I get my rotation. I'm going to move my rotation over there. Then I'm going to angle that at 15 degrees. So now I've got my shape. I'm going to take my two point line and you'll see right there it says intersection because I'm snapped to. And then here it's going to say node. Now I'm going to take my smart fill tool and I'm going to fill in that shape. We can actually get rid of our guidelines now. I'm going to click on our shape and I'm going to go no fill and for the video I'm going to make it blue so you can see the difference. Now once you have a rectangle you could make one corner rounded all four corners rounded depending whether your lock is locked and we'll just go through my locks unlocked and I'm going to change this top one to 25 of an inch or I did 25 inches 0.25. So I've got a little rounded corner, but the other ones are square. That's because I had this unlocked. And just we'll just go over that real quick. So if you have this locked and you do 0.25, now all four corners are rounded. But that's not what we're wanting. But you can't do that on another shape. Your rounded corners have gone away. But you can go to Windows, Dockers. Scallop, fillet, and chamfer. And we're going to fillet this one inch radius. So he wants these bottom two to be square, go back to square. We we'll just take your shape tool and select all those, left click them, and turn it into a line. Let's back up here. You could also select them and go right here and turn them into a line. Then, because we got snap to, we're going to snap, whoop, I've got them all selected. Let's back up here. Unselect, select that one. It'll snap to that corner. Snap to that corner. You wouldn't have to, but you could delete these two nodes. You don't need them. Now we use our color fill, and we have a perfect part that is rounded on the edges, on the top two, and square on the bottom. Anyway, I hope that helped him a little bit, and thank you for watching.